The Chevrolet 90 degrees V6 family of V6 engines began in 1978 with the Chevrolet 200 CU in 3.3L as the base engine for the all-new 1978 Chevrolet Malibu. The original engine family was phased out in early 2014, with its final use as the 4.3L 262 CU in V6 engine used in Chevrolet and GMC trucks and vans. Its phase-out marks the end of an era of Chevrolet small-block engine designs dating back to the 1955 model year. A new generation V4.3 L 262 CU in V6 variant entered production in late 2013, based on the LT1 small-block V8 used in the 2014 Chevrolet Silverado. Topic. Generation I. These engines have a 90 degrees V block with 12 valves activated by a pushrod valve train. All engines have cast iron blocks and cylinder heads. The engines are based on the Chevrolet small block engine, and the V6 is formed by the removal of the number 3 and number 6 cylinders. The V6s share the same 4.4 inch 110 mm bore spacing and 9.025 inch 229.2 mm deck height as the V8 engines. Many parts are interchangeable between the 90 degrees V6 and the small block V8 including valve train components, bearings, piston assemblies, lubrication and cooling system components, and external accessories. The 90 degree V6 engine uses the same transmission bell housing pattern as the Chevrolet small block V8 engine. The oil pan dipstick is located on the passenger side above the oil pan rail. This design was phased in on both the V690 and small block Chevrolet assembly lines for engines manufactured after 1979, sharing the same casting dies. All the engines use a 1, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2 firing order. The engines in this family are longitudinal engines, and have been used in rear-wheel drive cars and trucks, industrial, and marine applications. As of 2012, the Chevrolet 90 degrees V6 is currently produced at the GM Powertrain Division plant in Romulus, Michigan. Topic. 3.3L 200 SID Introduced in 1978, the 200 CU in 3.3L replaced the larger 250 CU in 4.1L as the base engine for Chevrolet's new downsized intermediate line. The 200 CU in 3.3L used a unique 3.5 by 3.48 inch 88.9 mm times 88.4 mm bore and stroke. The Chevrolet 305 and 350 CU in 5.0 and 5.7L V8 engines shared the same stroke dimension. These bore and stroke dimensions were later used by the 267 CU in 4.4L V8 Chevrolet engine. Also like the small block V8 engines, the 200 CU in 3.3L V6 used 2.45 inch 62.2 mm main bearings and 2.1 inch 53.3 mm rod bearing diameters. Being a 90 degree V6, Chevrolet took steps to eliminate the rough running tendencies of the 200. The crankshaft has each of its connecting rod throws offset by 18 degrees for each pair of rods. This required the connecting rods to have 0.05 inch 1.3 millimeters narrower ends as well as a thrust bearing to be installed between each pair of rods. However, the connecting rods were still the same 5.7 inch 140 millimeters length as most other small block Chevrolet V8 engines. This produced an engine with a semi-even fire sequence of 132 degrees, 108 degrees. The 200 CU in 3.3 L V6 was only produced for 1978 and 1979. It was available only with a two-barrel carburetor. In 1978, the 200 CU in 3.3L used the Rochester 2GC carburetor and in 1979 it used a Rochester Dualjet carburetor. The smaller dualjet carburetor caused a slight decrease in power. <laughs> 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 
Topic 3.8 L 229 SID. The 229CU in 3.8L engine was first introduced for the 1980 model year. This engine replaced the 250CU in 4.1L straight six in full-size Chevrolets and Camaros as the new base V6. Additionally, the intermediate Chevrolet Malibu and Monte Carlo also used the 229CU in 3.8L as a replacement for both the 200CU in 3.3L V6 and the 231CU in 3.8L Buick V6. Checker Motors Corporation also used this engine starting with its 1980 A11 taxi and A12 marathon sedans. Both the Buick V6 and the 229CU in 3.8L Chevrolet V6 are 90-degree V6 engines, and both are often referred to as the 3.8L V6. These engines should not be confused as being the same, and are completely unique engine designs. The 229CU in 3.8L has a 3.736 by 3.48 inch 94.9 mm x 88.4 mm bore and stroke, identical to the Chevrolet 305CU in 5.0L V8 engine. The 229CU in 3.8L used the same 2.45 inch 62.2 mm main bearing and 2.1 inch 53.3 mm rod bearing diameters as the 200CU in 3.3L V6 engine. Also like the 200CU in 3.3L V6, the 229CU in 3.8L use the same crankshaft with the 18 degree offset throws and the same 5.7 inch 140 mm connecting rods with 0.05 inch 1.3 mm narrowed ends. It came equipped with 1.84 inch 46.7 mm intake valves and 1.5 inch 38.1 mm exhaust valves. The 229CU in 3.8L V6 was only equipped with a two-barrel carburetor. For 1980 the 229CU in 3.8L used a mechanical dualjet. From 1981 to 1984 the electronic dualjet was used along with the GMCCC computer command control system. The 229CU in 3.8L was rated between 110 and 115 horsepower 86 kilowatts. Topic 4.3L 262 SID The 4.3L 262CU in V6 is the last and most successful engine in the Chevrolet 90 degree V6 engine family. This engine was introduced in 1985 as a replacement for the 229CU in 3.8L V6 in the full size Chevrolet, the Chevrolet El Camino, and Chevrolet Monte Carlo. It also replaced the 250CU in 4.1L in the Chevrolet full-size trucks and full-size vans including the mid-sized Astro as the new base six-cylinder engine. The 4.3L 262CU in V6 has a 4 in times 3.48 in 101.6 mm times 88.4 mm bore and stroke, identical to the 350CU in 5.7L Chevrolet V8 engine. To create a true even fire engine, Chevrolet produced a crankshaft with 30 degree offsets between each rod pin. Consequentially, rod journals were increased to a larger 2 and a quarter inches, 57.2 millimeters. The connecting rods used on the 4.3L 262CU in are therefore unique to this engine, being 5.7 inches, 140 millimeters in length, but having the larger 2 and a quarter inches, 57.2 millimeters journals. 
The 4.3L 262CU in also used larger valves than the 229CU in 3.8L V6, with a 1.94-inch intake valve and a 1.5-inch exhaust valve also shared with the 350. In 1986 and 1987, the 4.3L 262CU in engine saw engine design up upgrades similar to the Chevrolet small block V8. In 1986, the rear main crankshaft oil seal was changed from a two-piece to a one-piece seal. Some 1985 model year vehicles would have a 1986 engine due to service replacement. Cylinder blocks were shipped with oil pans. 1987 saw new center bolt valve covers and hydraulic roller lifters for the 1992 model year. The 4.3L 262CU in had its block design modified to allow a balance shaft to be installed. Even though the 4.3L 262CU in is an even fire V6, the 90 degree block layout is not ideal for smoothness. The balance shaft on the 4.3L 262CU in is installed above the top timing gear and runs through the top of the lifter valley. It is gear driven off the timing chain, and therefore a new timing chain cover was designed for these balanced 4.3L V6s. Balance shaft engines do not have provisions for a mechanical fuel pump unlike the non-balance shaft motors which retained the cast in BOSS. As of the 2013 model year, the 4.3L 262CU in was still in production although the distributor was eliminated in the late 2000s where a coil on plug ignition system using a 58X crankshaft position sensor based on the Gen IV LSX was phased in. This resulted in a new design timing cover with a wider bottom flange, making it incompatible with the 1996-06 LU 3 per liters 35. The only vehicles using the 4.3L 262CU in, by that time were the GMT 900 light-duty trucks and vans. As of March 7, 2014, the last 4.3L 262CU in engine rolled off the line at Romulus Powertrain. Chevrolet Performance still lists the LU3 motor in their product catalog. Mercury Marine, which sells its engines under the Mercruiser brand, developed a 4.5 LV6 based on the 4.3L 262CU in architecture using similar dimensions. Topic: LB1 and LB4 In 1985, the 4.3L 262CU in was either equipped with throttle body fuel injection, RPO LB4 or a Rochester Quadrajet 4-barrel carburetor, RPO LB1. The Chevrolet Caprice, Chevrolet Monte Carlo, Chevrolet El Camino, Pontiac Parisienne, and Pontiac Grand Prix used the LB4 rated at 130 horsepower, 97 kilowatts. Pickups and vans used the LB1 version rated at 155 horsepower, 116 kilowatts. The LB1 used in trucks and vans was referred to as Vortec in Chevrolet literature, named after a combustion chamber design known as a swirl port which twists the fuel mix from the intake ports as introduced on the Cavalier 2.0 L motor, and this name continued to be used with all truck and van 4.3 L 262CU in V6s until present day. In 1986, the 4.3L 262CU in engine used in passenger cars saw an increase in power to 140 horsepower, 104 kilowatts. This engine remained unchanged until 1990 when it was last used in taxi and police Chevrolet Caprices. In 1986, the Chevrolet Astro and GMC Safari vans used the fuel injected LB4 instead of the LB1. In 1987, the Chevrolet full-size pickups and full-size vans were upgraded to use the LB4 throttle body injection version of the 4.3L 262CU in. The mechanical fuel pump boss was retained but the hole was undrilled. Marine applications had the fuel pump boss drilled and tapped. 
From 1987 onwards LB4's output was 160 horsepower 119 kilowatts for pickups, while full-size vans were rated at 150 horsepower 112 kilowatts. In 1988 the S-Series trucks and S-Blazer and Jimmys had the LB4 4.3L as an available option the accessory drive was upgraded to a serpentine belt drive, which later replaced the 2.8 as the base V6. The LB4 continued until 1996 with minor variations in power, but without any major change. While a majority of LB4s did not have a balance shaft, some 1994 model year engines may have a balance shaft since production of the cylinder block used on the L35 was phased in for both induction systems. The 1994 model year was the final time a non-balance shaft cylinder block was used. Production 1995 TBI engines were all balance shaft engines. Legend 1 Chevrolet C, K trucks, GMC C, K trucks 2 Chevrolet G series vans, GMC G series vans 3 Chevrolet Astro vans, GMC Safari vans. Note, LB1 for 1985 only and LB4 not available 1995-4-1985 Chevrolet Impala, 1985-1988 Chevrolet Caprice, 1989-1990 Chevrolet Caprice Police, Taxi only, 1985-1986 Pontiac Parisienne 5 1985 1988 Chevrolet El Camino, GMC Caballero, Chevrolet Monte Carlo, 1986-1987 Pontiac Grand Prix, Note 140 horsepower, 104 kilowatts, LB4 used 1986-only 6 1988-1994 Chevrolet S10 Blazer, GMC S15 Jimmy and 1991 Oldsmobile Bravada 7 1995 Chevrolet S10 and GMC S15 Sonoma Topic LU2 For the 1990-1991 model years a high output 4.3L V6 was an available option for the Chevrolet Astro and GMC Safari vans. The LU2 used unique hyperutectic, strutless pistons and a more aggressive camshaft. Like the LB4, the LU2 used throttle body fuel injection, but was rated at 170 horsepower, 127 kilowatts, and 260 pound-feet, 353 Nm of torque. This engine was replaced in 1992 with the L35. Legend 1 Chevrolet Astro vans, GMC Safari vans, optional on extended length models. Topic. L35 CPI 1992 introduced a new version of the 4.3L in, the L35. This version of the 4.3L in, was equipped with CPI Central Port Fuel Injection. This system had one centrally located fuel injector to distribute fuel to six hoses each with a poppet valve to each of the intake ports. This system allowed for a multi-point fuel injection, using one injector. The fuel injection was a batch fire system and used a two-piece cast aluminum dual plenum manifold. This engine was available in Chevrolet S10 pickups, Chevrolet C, K pickups, and S10 Blazer, S15 Jimmy's SUVs, Chevrolet Astro and GMC Safari vans only. The L35 was rated at 200 horsepower, 149 kilowatts, and 260 pound-feet, 353 Nm of torque. The cylinder block was redesigned for use with a balance shaft. Cylinder heads 10,238,181 casting used with the L35 will have intake ports with eyebrows that clear the fuel injectors. Timing cover flange area was thickened in 1995 when some of the balance shaft motors had a 6 bolt timing cover. Some engines had a crankshaft position sensor, in conjunction with a redesigned distributor containing a pickup assembly which functions as a camshaft position sensor, when OBDII was phased in. Legend 
One Chevrolet Astro Vans, GMC Safari Vans, note STD on AWD, opt on two WD models. Two Chevrolet S10 Blazer, GMC Jimmy and Oldsmobile Bravada, note Oldsmobile Bravada not produced in 1995. 3 Chevrolet S10 and GMC Sonoma engine standard equipment with the S10 SS and Sonoma GT. Topic L35 and LF6 SCPI and MPFI. Major design changes were made to the 4.3L 262CU in V6 for the 1996 model year. Like other small block Chevrolet V8s, the 4.3L 262CU in engine received redesigned heads which had improved airflow and combustion efficiency. These heads are referred to as Vortec heads. The engine block was revised with structural reinforcing ribs up front eliminating the two freeze plugs on the front and back along with an alloy oil pan for the S10, Blazer, and Jimmy. The 1996 Plus cast aluminum oil pan has 12 bolts where a 16-bolt oil pan from the earlier 4.3 does not interchange. These 4.3L 262CU in 1996-2000 came with a redesigned 4L6OE with a removable bell housing which bolts to the oil pan. Crankshafts manufactured for the 1999 model year to the end of 4.3L 262CU in production had a pilot hole depth of 1.41 in 35.8 mm when coupled to the LSX-based 4L6OE, which had a redesigned torque converter pilot hub which is longer and used with a 300 mm in stator shaft. The torque converter pilot hub is longer than the early 4L6OE similar in appearance to the 700R4C, 1993-95 or the second generation variants incorporating a removable bell housing with the GMT-330 or 1996-2000C, K-series. This engine came in two versions, the LF6 rated at 175 to 180 horsepower, 130 to 134 kilowatts, and the L35 rated at 180 to 200 horsepower, 134 to 149 kilowatts. Only the S series pickups use the LF6, while the full-size trucks, vans and Blazer and Jimmy use the L35 version. The L35 was optional on the S-Series trucks. Legend 1 Chevrolet C, K trucks, GMC C, K trucks 2 Chevrolet Express, GMC Savannah vans 3 Chevrolet Astro vans, GMC Safari vans 4 Chevrolet Blazer, GMC Jimmy, 1996-2001 Oldsmobile Bravada 5 Chevrolet S10 and GMC Sonoma 7 Chevrolet Silverado and GMC Sierra trucks Topic. LU3 and LG3 MPFI 2002 saw major changes to the 4.3L 262CU in fuel injection system for 2002 California Emission Chevrolet Astros, GMC Safaris, Chevrolet Silverados and GMC Sierras all came equipped with the updated LU3 4.3L 262CU in. 2003 saw the L35 discontinued and the LU3 replacing it in all other applications. A new variation was also introduced in 2003, the LG3. For 2004 to 2009 the LU3 has been the only 4.3L 262CU in produced. The biggest change to the LU3 and LG3 was the fuel injection system. These engines used a multipoint fuel injection system, with six Multec 2 fuel injectors mounted at each intake port on the manifold. GM recommends the Multec 2 Spider assembly, which is also available for the L30 and L31 small block V8 motors, as a replacement for the 1996-01 CPI injector Spider assembly since the poppet valves have been known to stick open. 
The sticking poppet valves have been attributed to ethanol fuel blends sold in the state of California. The composite upper intake manifold and cast aluminum lower intake from the L35 engine is also used on the LU3. The LG3 uses a cast aluminum upper intake and a cast iron lower intake. The lower intake eliminated the EGR valve. The LU3 also received a quiet cam to help reduce vibration at both idle and high engine speeds. This camshaft used the same lift and duration as the older design, but the cam was reprofiled to keep the valve lifters in full contact with the cam lobes as the cam ramps down. The LG3 was used in Chevrolet and GMCS series pickups and was only produced for 2003. The LU3 was used in the Chevrolet and GMC full-size trucks and vans, the Chevrolet Astro and GMC Safari vans and the Chevrolet S10 Blazer and GMC S15 Jimmy. The LG3 was rated at 180 horsepower, 134 kilowatts and 245 pound-feet, 332 Nm of torque. The LU3 was rated at 190 to 200 horsepower, 142 to 149 kilowatts and 250 to 260 pound-feet, 339 to 353 Nm of torque. For the 2007 Plus GMT 900 Silverado, Sierra trucks, the LU3 engine received a distributorless ignition system, the traditional distributor was eliminated where a stub shaft was used. Also the crankshaft sensor was upgraded to a 58x reluctor wheel, same as the Gen IV LSX, which resulted in the timing cover redesigned, this time the cover is aluminum alloy in lieu of the composite cover, the timing cover bolt pattern is not the same as the 1996-06 LU3 and L35. Legend 1 Chevrolet Silverado and GMC Sierra trucks 2 Chevrolet Express, GMC Savannah Vans 3 Chevrolet Astro Vans, GMC Safari Vans 4 Chevrolet Blazer and GMC Jimmy 5 Chevrolet S10 and GMC Sonoma 2WD 6 Chevrolet S10 and GMC Sonoma 4WD Topic Turbocharged LB44.3 LV6 In 1991 GMC introduced the GMC Cyclone Limited Edition truck that used a turbocharged 4.3 L262 CU in V6. This engine used a Mitsubishi TD-0617C turbocharger, Garrett water, air intercooler and electronic multi-point fuel injection. Although GM made these modifications to the engine, it was still referred to with the RPO LB4 code. The majority of the naturally aspirated LB FAS long block was shared with the turbo version. However, the vehicles that used the 4.3 L 262 CU in turbo engine also included RPO code ZR9. Internal engine upgrades included nodular iron main bearing caps, graphite composite head gaskets with stainless steel flanges and hyperutectic pistons which lowered the engine compression to 8.351. A unique intake manifold that used the 48 mm twin-bore throttle body from the 5.7 LTPI Corvette engine was used on the engine's top end. The turbocharged 4.3 L 262 CU in was last used in the GMC Typhoon in the 1993 model year. The engine produced 280 horsepower, 209 kilowatts at 4400 revolutions per minute and 360 pound-feet, 488 Nm of torque at 3600 revolutions per minute. Topic: Generation V Topic 4.3L 262 SID. 
Commencing with the 2014 model year, a new LV3 Ecotec 3 4300 based on the Gen V LT1 small block Chevrolet will become the new base motor for the next generation Chevrolet Silverado GMC Sierra light duty trucks and will be phased in throughout the rest of the truck fan line after the 2015 model year, which will signal an end to a design dating back to 1955. Like its small block V8 counterparts, GM Powertrain also sells the motor for marine and industrial applications. Topic LV3 The 4.3L 262.5 CU in LV3 V6 is a new engine announced by GM at the end of 2012. GM considers this a new engine design which inherits from its predecessors its displacement, two-valve pushrod valve train, 90-degree cylinder angle, and 4.4 in 111.8 mm bore centers. It is based on the fifth-generation LT engine and includes the same features such as direct injection, piston cooling jets, active fuel management, variable displacement oil pump, continuously variable valve timing and aluminum cylinder heads and block. The engine is say certified to 285 horsepower 213 kilowatts at 5,300 revolutions per minute and 305 pound-feet 414 Nm at 3,900 revolutions per minute on regular unleaded gasoline and 297 horsepower 221 kilowatts at 5,300 revolutions per minute and 330 pound-feet 447 Nm at 3,900 revolutions per minute on E85. Emissions are controlled by a close coupled catalytic converter, quick sync 58x ignition, returnless fuel rail, fast response O2 sensor. It was launched in the all new 2014 Chevrolet Silverado 1500 and 2014 GMC Sierra 1500. Applications 2014 present Chevrolet Silverado 1500. 2014 present GMC Sierra 1500 Topic See also GM high value engine 3.5 and 3 9 volt 6s Chevrolet small block engine General Motors small block engine equals equals notes